Joyce Meyer has said this, if you're going to be a person who is committed to the Word of God, you're going to have to learn to be led by the Spirit and not by your emotions. Oh, oh there's a biggie. So many times I have been led by my emotions, and so have you. So has every human being that is alive today or in the past. In Hebrews 10, verse 38, it says, The just shall live by faith. Hebrews 10, 38 teaches us that we should live by faith. And yet sometimes, despite our best intentions, feelings of doubt, feelings of fear rob us of the peace and the spiritual abundance that should be ours through Christ. Anger or anxiety can keep us from the blessing that God wants to bestow upon each of us. So, we must learn to put faith over feelings all the time. Human emotions, they're highly variable, decidedly unpredictable, and like the weather, they're even more fickle. <laughs> That's why God wants us to live by faith, not by the ups and downs of our emotional roller coaster. Sometime during this day, you'll probably be gripped by a negative emotion, and maybe it will be strong. Distrust it. Rein it in. Test it. Turn it over to God. Our emotions change, but God does not. So, trust God completely. And let your feelings slowly fade to be replaced by faith. They will be replaced by faith. They will soon be diluted under the power of God, the power of faith.